Good sail. Welcome back, Commander. Theater. Not what I expected. There's the camp. These ruins look old. I wonder who built them and when. What are those towers? Nothing but a tablet. I wonder what it says. So, the light beams are the key. Locked. I should check the tablet again. Aligned. Hm. Uh. 
Dawn has come. This looks to be in the right position. I think I've got it. There. That should work. Now to try the door. Finally. Now to find what lies within. Why would my father be here? It's hot in here. I should watch my step. What is this place? Time to take a dive.
This place is huge. Hello? Icarus! <laughs> Traitor. Greetings, Alexios. Welcome to Atlantis. Atlantis? Impossible. I thought it was just a myth. There are many secrets in this world that are hidden behind myth and legend. And who are you? My name is Pythagoras. I'm your father. Pythagoras? That doesn't make any sense. He died decades ago. Yes, almost a century if memory serves. And yet, here I am standing before you. And Icarus is... My oldest and dearest friend. I sent him to watch over you. And now, here you are. I've traveled a long way to meet my real father. You. You were not sent here for a family reunion. There are bigger things at stake. Why was I sent here? What's my role in all of this? I want answers. There is knowledge in this place. Powerful knowledge. In the wrong hands, its secrets could bring about the downfall of humanity. We cannot allow others to discover this place. We must find a way to seal it from the world forever. I don't understand any of this. I'm a warrior, not a scholar. We all have a purpose, Alexios. Yours was to help me protect the secrets of Atlantis. You're right. We must save the Greek world from itself. Above all things, trust yourself. You're capable of greatness. I'll do my best. The answers I seek are behind these mechanisms. They are sealed, and the artifacts to open them are missing. So I need to find the artifacts and return them to Atlantis? I've collected information that hints at where these artifacts may be located. However, they are incredibly powerful. They corrupt the minds of lesser people and possess a will to defend themselves. I'll bring them back. But I still have questions for you. And I have answers. For now, though, take this. It's part of a key to access an artifact that is hidden in Viotia. I have an ally trying to find the second half as we speak. Vera! We found Atlantis! Atlantis? Let me check your vitals. You're delirious! We've been searching for an Isu artifact with reality-bending powers, and this bothers you? Pythagoras was born around 570 BCE. That would make the man in that cave nearly 150 years old. What could possibly be keeping him alive? The staff of Hermes Trismegistus. Mrs. San, you were right. I'll help you pack up the gear. Thanks. Let's roll out.
I've reached the coordinates. The series of caves we detected should be right under me. My equipment's ready. Preparing to dive. Layla, you have no idea what's down there. There could be sharks. I prefer that to Templars. We'll keep an eye out for Upstabber. Good luck, Layla. Thanks. I'm heading down now. There has to be a way in. I'll find it. There! That must be the way in. Are you all still reading me? It's awfully quiet on comms. We hear you, Layla. Thanks. It's just so silent down here. You're not alone, Layla. We're monitoring your progress. You're doing fine. Yeah, we're here if you need us. Set the assassin sitting at the desk. Well, I don't have to be in a boat to be useful. I have loads of information on ancient Greece. Did you know that at Sacros, the Minoans built a graveyard so huge it was known as the Ravine of the Dead? Can we please not talk about death? Elena, promise me that if I die down here, you'll rename this place the Caves of the Dead. I'm on it. People! I'm gonna miss the London Loft. I really like the view. Miss it? Why can't you go back? Didn't you read Kyoshi's report? Abstergo's already swept through it. It's compromised. No, I've been busy researching Theta. Kyoshi, are you alright? Of course. After clearing out the last of her gear, I observed the infiltration from a distance. Did they pick up the present I left? Yes, they found the USB key you dropped under the desk. Nice tactic. No one at Abstergo will be stupid enough to stick that in a computer. They don't have to. It's a shell holding one of my special RFID transmitters. Get it anywhere near a workstation, like, say, in the head of security's office, and boom. Impressive. All in a day's hack. Wow. It's more elaborate than I could have imagined. How did they build all this? What I want to pay for an Isu toolbox. This is different from Egypt. Some aesthetic elements in common, but... Mm -mm. I should get out of this diving suit before I start exploring. It's real. I made it. Layla to Altair 2? I'm in. Do you have visuals? Yes! By the gods, Layla, it's Atlantis! How are you feeling? Any nausea from the pressure change? No, I'm fine. These rooms are... amazing. Think, Layla, think. There must be a way. Something has to power up this place. I'm re-entering the Animus. I need Alexis to show me how he got farther inside. I know there's not much time, but I need answers. I imagine you have many questions. I should go. Yes. There is much to do. Bring back the artifacts quickly. The longer we wait, the greater the risk of Atlantis being discovered. You have more questions? I have questions about my family. The sentimental and emotional connections formed between people have always irked me. I knew Mirini would fail to stay detached. Why is the cult hunting our family? 
It is our family's destiny to control the power in this place. In our blood lies the key to unlocking the secrets of Atlantis. So they want our blood? You have a destiny, my child, to destroy the cult and their influence on the Greek world. You threaten everything they have striven for because you have the power to oppose them. They've tried to destroy me and failed, and they'll never control me. If you've been here all these years, how did you meet my mother? We're both descendants of the people who built this place, just like you. We knew that we had an obligation to preserve our lineage. That's when you agreed to make me? In a manner of speaking, yes. Why did you come here and leave my mother and me in Sparta? I was never going to raise you. Our duty was to continue our ancient bloodline and ensure there was someone strong enough to do what was necessary when the time came. You could have brought us here with you. And you would have been unprepared. That's all I wanted to know. I want to know more about Atlantis and your work. There isn't enough time for me to explain even a fraction of what I have learned here. All I can offer for now is a hint of enlightenment. This place is like a tomb. How did you live down here? And for so long? This artifact, like your spear, possesses incredible power. It has given me life, so that I may continue to learn from this place. What have you been studying here? Everything. The first civilization's history, their culture, their science. With it, we can change humanity's destiny and usher in an age of enlightenment. Destiny is something only the gods can alter. They were gods, living, breathing gods. I've heard enough. What do I do with the artifacts? Just place them in their corresponding steelies, and the path to answers will illuminate. I should go. Yes. There is much to do. Bring back...
Go for Take you in to see the kings when you're ready. 
Waiting won't make this easier. They won't look kindly on you asking for favors without offering some kind of help first. Like taking care of the soldiers arming the Ilotes. You're right. We need this to go well. I'll come back. Leonidas. He was Sparta's last true hero. We'd all be under the yoke of the Persian Empire if it wasn't for his courage. The same blood courses through your veins. So, our blood is the blood of kings. You are so much more than a mercenary. You carry the blood of heroes, blood of power. Remember what I told you? That people would try to take that power for themselves. And then you promised. I wouldn't let them. Hold out your spear. All of this talk of the Pythia, the Pythia, I do not care what she says. Enough! We have grown tired of your insolent tongue. Sparta will not go to war. The Pythia has spoken. Pythia says what you tell her to say. She has been your puppet for far too long. The time has come to cut her strings. Oh, Leonidas, the days of heroes are over. You think your blood makes you special? If we opened your veins, it would spill to the ground and disappear through the cracks. You are no one. You are more than welcome to find out. Your fate is sealed, son of the lion. Xerxes will unite us. He will bring order to chaos. Divide the Pythia and everyone you love. Everything you stand for will perish. Gather them then. My king? Xerxes wants Sparta. You'll have to go through me. Incredible! Now do you understand? What must I do? It's time we embrace our destiny, both of us. If we don't stop the cult before it's too late, then all Leonidas fought and died for was for nothing. Our bloodline has reason to those who would enslave us. It's time we rise again. Well, well, well. Mother and son united in Sparta at last. And look at you, a god and goddess among mortals. King Pavsanias, we're honored. I was sorry to hear about your father. Yes. Our fathers would have been proud to see us here today. You remember Alexios, my king? Who could forget? The boy who died to save his sister. Such a tragedy. An innocent child put to death because of an ancient merciless law. Two innocent children were put to their deaths that day. Alexios, enough. Apologies, my king. He's been away from Sparta for a long time. You both have. This one has fire like his mother. <sighs> In any case, Sparta was weakened by losing you. Losing you both. We're examples of why these laws must change. Oh, I agree. But King Archidamos, if he could carve Spartan law across the chest of every citizen, he would. Spartan laws destroyed my family. Spartan laws had me claw my way through the streets. We're here today because he defied those laws. He did, and he lost his head for it. But we're not here to talk about the dead, are we? 
We know Sparta reclaimed our house after what happened to my father in Megaris. We want it back. Mind your tongue, child. You may not live in Sparta anymore, but I'm still your king. We graciously request an audience with you and King Archidamos to discuss reinstating our citizenship and reclaiming our home. Of course. There is nothing I'd want more. Archidamos, however, still hasn't forgiven you for the whole nose incident. What can we do to sway him? There's rumor of a Illot rebellion and the Kreptia are stalking the flames. Savagely killing Illots, stealing livestock and leaving corpses to rot in the streets. The Kreptia represents Sparta's ultimate achievement in military training. Their discipline and fearlessness make Sparta's army the most feared in the world. Once. But the Kreptia have become corrupt and bloodthirsty. And training boys to kill unarmed peasants is nothing to be proud of. Do you want your home back or not? Good. So the Illots will no longer support the senseless slaughtering of their people. If killing Kryptia will get our home back, I'll do it. You're not one of my soldiers. You better have a good reason for being here. I don't need the reason, good or otherwise. <laughs> some bite to you is there. More than some cowering dog. <laughs> From slave to general, bathing in the blood of this war while our leaders stuff their faces and preen. The Polemarchos believe it's an easy victory. I will end this war in my favor. You have a strategy? Athenian Polemarchos are paralyzed with indecision. They serve too many masters. Making them slow to react. And that's where you come in. Infiltrate their forts and kill the Polemarchos. I need a way clear for my troops. I'll do my part. Consider the commander is already dead. Bring me their Athenian seals as proof. You'll be rewarded for your efforts. He's trying to sell us longer spears. I didn't hurt. Huh. What do we need with yours? If Archidamos believes in the old ways, won't killing his Kriptia create conflict between him and Posonias? I miss Kefalonia sometimes. Life was simple, even if Marcos was a bumbling idiot. Stay hidden if I don't want to fight. Go! 
should be extra careful in this area. Yeah. 
I should try to stay out of sight. Found them, found him.
This is the marble quarry Brasidas mentioned. Better stay hidden. The weapons have to be here somewhere. There's only one spot in here that I need to kill. It'll be easier if I don't alert the others. I need to take down their commander. Did I see something? Victory! <laughs> One down, four to go. That's two. Time to find the others.
Three weapon racks destroyed. Won't take much longer. Only one more to go. Any of it. We should keep our eyes open and take it for ourselves. Ready to meet the kings? I'll let you know if I see it. Waiting won't make this easier. Then let's go. Your mother's already inside. Archidomos. I yield. Another two squadrons to Vietir, then. As I said. Is that how they solve arguments? Sometimes. Archidomos's guard has improved. He should thank me. Prasidas, you've come with news. Let's hear it. My kings. May I present Merini, descendant of Leonidas, and her son, Alexios. How dare you show your face in Sparta? Alexios helped me secure Corinthia, my king. He helped with the Ilotes rebellion. They want what's best for Sparta. I beg you to listen. Let's hear what they have to say before we bloody the palace floor. Speak, Marini. Why are you here? I have returned to reclaim my Spartan citizenship. ...to reclaim our home. You exiled yourself. Your son killed an elder and ran. Not to mention the crooked nose he gave you. My family was betrayed, my king. Sparta was betrayed. We've come to expose these traitors. <laughs> you haven't cared for Sparta for many years. Then blame me. I killed the elder. I started all of this. So... If you want someone to prove their loyalty, it should be me. I'm not sure if I should congratulate you on your honesty. 
or punish you for the crime you've just confessed. Marini has made her intentions known. What are yours? My intentions are to hunt down those who betrayed my family and Sparta, and kill them. And who exactly do you think betrayed Sparta? That's what I'm here to find out. First, prove yourself loyal. Bring glory to Sparta, and redeem yourself in the eyes of the gods. Until then, neither you nor your mother have a right to your lands. Tell me what I must do, and it will be done. The Spartan army fights the Athenians in Viotia. Join the commanders there. Come back victorious, or do not return. Consider the battle won. Spoken with the confidence of a child who hasn't seen real war. You will find my commander out of Mount Helicon. Give him this and tell him I sent you. Not so fast. Two kings, two tasks. Heracles completed twelve. Two shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> First Spartan thing you've said all day. The Olympics will be starting soon in Elise, and our fighting champion requires an escort. You want me to be an escort? I want you to make sure the Spartans return with a wreath. <coughs> That's how he'll bring glory to Sparta? By winning an event in the Olympics? Not an event, my king. By making sure Sparta wins the entire Olympics. <sighs> Perfect. You have your orders. We'll see you when your tasks are completed. If they're completed. I'll get them done, and you'll give us back our home. There's some Spartan left in you after all. Prasidas. Show them out. Next! That went well. Considering you still have your head on your shoulders, yes, I'd say it went very well. The kings were generous to give us a second chance. And all I have to do is win the Olympics. And a war. Is there anything you need to know before setting off? One of the kings is a cultist. So, one of these tasks is surely a trap. But, which one? Brasidas? Wouldn't say that within earshot of the palace. But I fought with both of them. I can't believe either is a traitor. We need to find proof before we make any accusations. Keep your eyes open. I think I'm ready. And you? What will you do while I'm gone? I received a message just before we went in. What kind of message? A clue to the whereabouts of another cultist. I'm going to Arcadia. Alone? The fates are smiling on us. I was ordered there. We can travel together. That would be helpful. My thanks. I'll meet you both in Arcadia then. Safe journeys. <laughs>